Hey house my friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are here at Zamzo's and we are gonna go I think to three different Zamzo's and I don't know if I'm gonna do a full plant tour every single one because they might have like similar or kind of like the same plants so I don't want to be super repetitive but we are starting at the Eagle one and then we're gonna go to the state one and then we're gonna go to the Fairview one. And my friend Jasmine is gonna be here with us. I don't know if she wants to be in the video though, so I'll have to figure that out later. If you see me like talking to someone, that's who I'm, I'm with a person. I don't think I'm gonna be buying any plants. I always say that and then I always sometimes end up getting, I shouldn't say always, I haven't bought a plant in a really long time, but the goal is to not spend any money and to just be window shopping and to make content. Let's go ahead and go in. Before we get started, thank you so much to Zimf for sponsoring this video. Zimf is where I get all of my super cute glasses. This pair is Aphrodite. Wow, look at those clouds. This pair is Aphrodite, and you can use code Ashley to get 50% off frames and 20% off lenses. This is Rhea. This is my other favorite pair. And then these are their two newer styles. They're called like their TikTok glasses. Here's the side. They're so pretty. And then they're actually like glittery around the edges, but the glitter is actually inside of the lens. So it's not glittery or uncomfortable around the side. There's no glitter. And it won't like come off on your stuff. Here's another one. I personally really like this one a lot, but yeah, thank you so much Zim for sponsoring this video. And if you're interested in any of these pairs, they're all listed. All of my favorite pairs are listed in my link tree down below when you go to the Zim page in my link tree. So yeah, thank you so much for listening to my cute little ad and let's go inside. Okay, so we're in the Zamzos and this one is always really expensive, so I don't usually buy anything from the Eagle one, but they do have some really pretty plants. So they have this tissue culture solderoy, well, soderoy, and everything here is pretty expensive. So these are 20, but then you have this $75 Milano Chrysum. It's very big. But when we go to the next location, you'll see that they're way more expensive at this location than that location, which is just kind of weird. And then we have a Brantianum. This is actually a really good price. This one's only uh, $13. We have a Syngonium Batik, which is fun. $12. The prices here just don't make sense. <laughs> they just don't. Big Epipremnum. And then this is actually a plant that I do want. It's like a jade syndapsis. And I just think it's really fun. See, like how pretty. Then up here, we have some Hoyakonosa Compacta Vergata. So these are $21. This is the only one that really looks kind of nice. It's like a very pretty one. But yeah, 21 Here's the other ones. Here's kind of the store. It's a super pretty store. Over here we have some Hoya macrophylla or Latifolia macrophylla. These are 21 as well. And then Hoya reverse variegated Wayetti eyes. And then Crimson Queen and Crimson Princess. Over here we have some Stromanthi Trio stars, which are super pretty. These are $13.99. And they're super pretty. We have a ton of Aglionema. Up here we do have some String of Pearls, which is adorable. This one is $26.99 and this one is $32.99. I think that they're different uh, distributors. Over here we have a couple different types of lipstick plants. This one is really pretty. That's actually gorgeous. This is Ashenanthus Bolero. Bi color. That's bizarre. We have Black Pagoda lipstick, which is super fun and it's red on the underside. We have Diffenbach Reflector for $10. That's so bizarre. That's so weird. These used to be like a couple hundred dollars two or three years ago. Another little string of pearls. 
Senecio Macro Glosses or the Wax Ivy. I love these and this is one of the first plants I literally ever bought four years ago from Edwards. Literally one of my first plants. We have some Sable Blue Epipremnum. These ones are kind of sad. It's not a whole lot to them. Over here there's a ton of money trees and then some Biliaceae. These Philodendron Biliaceae are $46.99. This leaf is super pretty. And then this little tiny dude, I forget what these are. Winlandii, Syngonium Winlandii. Got Syngonium Winlandii as well. I guess that one's just a weird small one. A larger Winlandii. And a couple of different kinds of Calathea that are super pretty. But yeah, money tree heaven right here. I already checked them and I did not find sports. On the back side over here, we have some Begonia Berkeleyi. This is not the silver edge version. And then we have some standard Epipremnum. This is just Epipremnum. I was like, what a weird shape of blue, but no, it's literally just an Epipremnum. <laughs> and then they have some uh, Sissus Discolor, which is super fun. And this one is $16.99. That's super pretty. Over here we have all of the cactus on the big cactus table. Right behind me we have a ton of alocasia and monstera siltabacana. We have alocasia mellow, some alocasia cupria, and some anthurium radicans. Tucked in over here, we have more Siltabacana. Oh, hey, a Mikan's. Mikan's for 13. It's not super pretty, but that's a pretty good price. You could just rehab it. A Pilea Peppergomioides. They have a ton of these over there. Got some Monstera Peru, the unvarigated kind. And a bunch of Hoya Carina Vergana. These are so cute. Oh my gosh. These are $27. That's actually adorable. I wish they were with the other Hoya. Look at this one. That one is so pretty. $27. Okay, they have these uh, peace lilies here. They're Spathophyllum Jessica. And they're like, they're gorgeous. Look at the ruffles, they go all the way down. They're kind of like a plowmanii. This is literally the coolest piece of I've ever seen in person. These Mikans, I feel like the Mikans there are always like $25 for like a small strand, yeah. you know? These are honestly really lush Mikans. They have like some blemishes but it's not white or anything. It's literally just like the leaves got burned, I think, in, in transit. They're all $13 for like a whole pot. And the pots are like a pretty good size. Then we have some little Billy Tays. These ones, hello price. I wonder if these ones are cheaper. Hello, sir, do you have a price? Oh, they're both chateau, so they're probably cheaper. Am I insane or do these like not have a price? So this one was sticker. Yeah, I pulled out three and none of them have a sticker. They're both chateau, so I feel like they're like 20 bucks. But I can't say for certain. Because both chateau plants are usually cheap as fuck. Really? Yeah. I don't even pay attention. <laughs> That's why I know what Beau Chateau is because they're so cheap. Every time I see plants from Beau Chateau, they're like so, so, so cheap. Okay, then we have like a ton of these hanging plants. They're all kind of like more common, so there's a difference of, you know, some Syngonium or some normal Hoya Carnosa. We have Syngonium Erythrophyllum here, some more Perus. Epipremnum Enjoy. I want to call everything a syndapsis because it's so fun to say. <laughs> what is this? Is this like a Florida or is it like a Squamiferum? This one's like a Squamiferum. Florida. $10 Squamiferum. 
That's actually broken. That's actually awesome. I was just thinking about how I wanted a Squammy the other day. It really is. Not gonna make any choices though yeah. until we go to the other one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love the variegated piece of lace, dude. I'm glad you like this location because I love going to this one and then I go to the other one and I'm like. These are just so much like cuter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I might get one of these. It is cute. I just love, it'll go so nice with my, uh, with my serpents. <laughs> You know, they'll match. <laughs> and here is kind of the whole store. Jasmine was saying that she thinks this is the best one she's been to, which is honestly really makes me feel good because I was like, we should go to the Eagle one. <laughs> and then here's this side. Then all of the plants over here, just in case I miss something. They have a lot of normal string of hearts, but I don't really talk about these because they're not like my favorite thing. I prefer the variegated ones. But yeah, that's this location. I think my top picks of this location are the $9.99 Squamiferum and this $20 Jessica, I think is awesome. So we have these Anthurium clarinervium. We were like on our way out and I totally, totally missed them. Oh, they're calling them pterodactyl. That's not right. Pterodactyls are the pedato radiatum, like the five finger. Oh, I know. So it's just completely misnamed, but that's okay. That's okay, Zamzos. We don't expect that much from you. The fact that you have the plants is enough. <laughs> we know what they're called. <laughs> you can also call this the king Anthurium and people would get this in the Warakwianum or a Vichai, and they'd be like, king and queen, and it was like cute. Mm -hmm. I remember those Instagram posts. All right, we are at the next location, and I already see some really fun plants, so let's take a look. So I love this location because this is the location that always has like all of the really fun plants. As you can see, we have like a case here of a bunch of super fun plants, including this massive, Velvet leaf anthurium. This is anthurium metallicum. It's huge. We also have some syngonium three kings, a Thai constellation. That's like a really, a really nice one. Have some syngonium albopodophyllum for 66. That's a huge one. Some philodendron gloriosum. 75 and then some more tycons I have some white princess I have got a couple of these ones these are 67 check out this one this one is gorgeous that's literally so pretty and hiding right in front of me we have a little ring of fire Ooh, $26. That's awesome. That's a super high color too. Aw, and then tucked in here, got a little serpents. Look at that. That's so cute. Serpents is definitely the most expensive at $88.99. If this were like even 20 bucks, I would get this because this would go so well in my cabinet. Over here, we have a bunch of really cute Hoya. Got some Hoya Gray Salas over here for $8.99. Some, I think normal way, any guy. Pubic calyx. We have some Hoya Carnosa Compacta Air Goddess here. These are $20.99. Oh, look at the tiny fly. What a cute fly. But then down here, we have some Beau Chateau plants. These are all $8.00 and we have Latifolia. Lots of folia macrophylla, some variegated wayetti eyes, and parasitica black, which are super cute. We also have some hoya australis. And then down here we have a lot of hoya croniana black, and then hoya croniana splash. They have some really nice cactus here. They have some myrtio cactus geometrizans. 
super fun to me. And Mere Tio Cactus, Geometrizans, Monstrous. We have some Fellow Cactus Hex. Oh gosh, Hexadrophorus. I love this. Up high, there's a ton of string of string of pearls, and then string. Oh, I don't even know what that is. Oh, it's a codaline. Those are just normal succulents. And then some string of dolphins. Here we have some. Oh gosh, what are you? A Gloria summary. Pasta Zana. Wow. These are $23.99. I actually haven't seen one of these in like two years. Not since I was in Portland last. Philodendron Pasta Zana. Some little Soderoys. These are tissue culture. <gasps> the Mikans. These are gorgeous. Oh my gosh. These are like actually gorgeous. How much are the little ones? $14. Oh, it might be a Mikan's kind of day. Look at these Mikan's. They're way prettier. How much are they? they? These ones are the same price, so $13. These ones are $26 and they're huge. I know! <laughs> Look at this one. Oh my gosh. And they have a whole cart of them in here. All of these. Ooh, this one. In the middle. This one's huge. These are. Yeah, these are huge. Oh, these are good. Is it a Mikan's day? Do I get a Mikan's? <laughs> might be a Mikan's. I might get one of those tiny cute ones because they. Like, ah! Oh my gosh, I'm so glad your phone's okay. Oh, I love your little lanyard. Oh, that's so cute. The little leaf. My poor phone. I'm so glad your phone's okay. Like, look at this. For $13? That's beautiful. Oh, that might be the one. That's a really pretty I might get that. We're going to tuck it right here. Yeah, the first one is really nice. But this juicy leaf is like... My eyes. That's good. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> like these kind of birds nesty ones, which I don't really love. They do have some silver swords. These are $10.99 and $11.99. I wonder why they have different prices. <laughs> That's weird. Got some normal jungle boogies and then some Birkins. Birkins are $12. I personally don't think Birkins should be sold for more than five because they're everywhere. Got a Squammy here. $28 Squamiferum. That's amazing. I wonder if they have any four inch ones at this location. That's so cute. Then over here we have some Philodendron Summer Glories and some Fuzzy Petioles. That's what this is called, Fuzzy Petiole. On the back over here, we have a couple different types of ficus. We have ficus audrey, and then we have some ficus taniki, altissima, ruby, and then some kinds that I don't really know. Ooh, water. Over here, we have a bunch of different bachia. I don't even know what they're all called. Some aglionema sprinkled in here as well, but they have all the pretty kinds. Whoever runs, this Samso's location is a serious plant parent. Wow. Isn't it weird how you can tell which Samso's you go to? Like, who runs it that loves plants? Yeah. yeah. Like, this is a crazy selection. I feel like for, uh, are the worst. Oh, they really are. <laughs> oh, this is cute. I actually love Macroyana. Those so trios pretty. are white. Fusions are really good too. Oh, they're so pretty. Yeah, I did. Ooh! Are you joking? Look at that. This is the craziest variegation I've ever seen. $22. That's literally, that's literally insane. It has a couple full white leaves. 
Oh my gosh! It's literally gorgeous. Wow. Yeah, they have literally so many begonias. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, Amphioxus, that's so fun. This, like, back in 2019, it was like $200. What? Yeah. There was like two um, plant YouTubers who were like obsessed with them and they made them so expensive. Really? Yeah. I also really like this one. But that is so cool. I don't know. That's like one of the plants that I'm just gonna have to like adore. Yeah. It's just, it's so pretty, but I don't think I want to spend $20 on a piece lily. Yeah. Wait, do they have easy here? Yeah, they're so easy. I had two at home, but then I downsized to just one. Wow, all these begonias though are so pretty. Everything's in such good shape. Yeah, no, this store is like amazing. This is pretty much just a bona fide plant shop like on its own. Their begonia maculatas look really good too. I feel like normally people kill those yeah. in the store. And they have all the good syngonium. $6 when Landii at the other store. These were 15. Wow. Pterodactyl again. Yeah, Jasmine <laughs> found the anthurium section. See, this is this is the pterodactyl. Yeah, but they're calling it Pedataridium, which is what it's called. Oh, okay. So, like, that's its genus name or species name. Snowbush! Oh, Isn't it cute? So cute? Yeah, Edward sells those and I love them. Oh, look, they're flowering. That's cute. That's actually so cute. Over here looks like our clearance section. This location does not have four inch spawn the which is sad. We have a hidden stash of Red Anderson back here. 67. Am I right? Is it Red Anderson? Oh, they're calling this a white knight, but that's not a white knight. Wait. Oh, it is. Duh. Why am I calling it a Red Anderson? I just got owned by a plant tag. Um, there's, so there's wizards and knights, and then there's princesses. I'm calling it an Anderson because I'm dumb. Okay. But this is actually a really nice one. Really pretty Monstera. Yeah. Wow. I, I just love it. One. Yeah, that's okay. It was one of my favorite plants. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like it. I prefer the ones that aren't like the wide form. I like the standard like form. Not even narrow form, but there's just like the, the normal form. Oh, okay. It has like really weird fenestrations always. and. I like that. I did have though for like ever. Yeah, those are the nice ones. The other location had the the normal form. Seems like everyone else left. Let's go. <laughs> I like whatever this is. It looks so weird. Is that a Pelea? Pelea? I don't even know. Yeah, it looks like an elephant. Yeah, kinda. Peperomia. Oh, it's Peperomia Hope. Oh, it's just a massive one. It kind of looks like a string of nickels. I used to have a really pretty one. Yeah, I had a tiny one that wouldn't grow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry if my face is red. It's so hot in here. Like, it's very warm. But I'm trying to decide. I'm trying to decide if I want to get a Mikan's or if I want to wait because we're going to. Greenscape Boutique later to film after one more Zamzo's location. And they might have some cool, I think I'll just wait and then I know that it's here. I'm gonna be really smart. It's so pretty though. I really want a Mikan's really bad. Okay, so Jasmine is getting this Mikan's, which I think we both agree is like one of the most beautiful ones we've ever seen. And it's <laughs> super pretty.
All right, we're at the final, final Zamzo's location. They're so cute. Oh, little friends. <laughs> so after looking around for a minute, it looks like everything here is kind of the same as the other locations we've been to, except they do have Hoya Crassiopatola, which is really cute. It's kind of like a Callistophyla dupe. It's $8.99. I do really want a Callistophyla though. But this one's really pretty. We have more variegated Hoya Carissa Compactas, lipstick plants, some carry eyes, standard compactas. Got like a cute little Gloriosum up here. $50. It's bizarre because Home Depot has these now for 15 bucks. <laughs> okay, so part of me thinks that they're just getting better at breeding these because this is like the third cool one I've seen. Here are the Polly's, the Malos, the Cuprias. Ooh, it's a green app. We haven't seen this yet today. That's fun. No price though on it, which is unfortunate. Thing right, Alocasia? That's all cute. No price again. Sad. Oh, the another snow bush, yeah. I kind of like this. It's an outdoor plant, I think, but it's cute. I don't even know what that is. Wow, these are the biggest Clethia orbifolia I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. That was like my favorite plant when I got into them. Oh, me too. I still love them, but <sighs> yeah, I'm trying to keep plants that I won't just waste. <laughs> <laughs> that little yeah. This oh, this one's huge. Yeah. Well, I guess you didn't get the Adansonii at the other place, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How come the other Shiveriana is so expensive, and these ones are twenty dollars? I'm just starting to like these. I wonder why I sold mine. You wonder why you sold yours? <laughs> I'm like, why did I look? Every shop you go to, I'm like, maybe I should get another one. Like, why did I sell it? <laughs> Alright, let's go back to the other one. Yeah, okay, these are, are like half the price of the other tiny one. Yeah. What's up with that? I don't know. Are you ready? I thought we'd chat for a second while I drive. Don't worry, I'm completely hands free. I always have a really hard time with that Zamzo's location. I, okay, so they have this tiny dying Shiveriana. I don't know if I showed it to you or not, but it's literally, they had it originally listed for like $48 and they listed it as 50% off. So they were trying to sell it for, I think it was actually $49. It was almost 50 and half price was just about $26, which is more expensive than the full, like the full Shiveriana that were 25 or 24. And so I was like, hey, could I get a discount? Like, can you give it to me for like, you know, five, $10? Because it's literally, it's dying, <laughs> you know? And she's like, oh, well, we can't really do that because we do still have to make a profit, but it's like literally no one is going to buy that. Dead ass. <laughs> zero. Zero people are going to buy that. So it's like... It's just gonna die. <laughs> and I don't know. It's just annoying. It's like any other location. The other two that we were at, if I asked that, they would have said yes. Or even the location over on Overland. Um that I really like to go to, like same thing. If I if I asked that, they would have said yes because they're like, oh, it, you're gonna get no profit <laughs> when it dies, which it's going to because no one is going to pay twenty six dollars for like a tiny dying plant. And how they don't see that, I don't know. Doesn't make sense to me, but that's okay. But yeah, I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna go back. That's like my first time going back to that location in a really long time. And I don't think I'm gonna go back to it again. I think I'm just gonna stick to the other locations, which just sucks because that location used to be an amazing Zamzo's location. And now it's like, 
it's honestly kind of one of the worst ones in terms of the plants, in terms of like how the plants are cared for. I don't know, it's just unfortunate. It's all right, I live and die for the State Street location. <laughs> Hey y'all, thank you so much for watching this video. I did not end up purchasing any plants, so um, that was the last location I went to in the video. I don't know why I didn't film like a real outro, but thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next houseplant section, and thank you so much, Zinth, for sponsoring this video. If you want to check out my glasses, you can look at the link tree in the description box to see my entire list of favorites glasses. And don't forget to use code Ashley at checkout for 50% off frames and 20% off lenses. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. And check out the pregnancy vlogs if you haven't.